Hello, this is Uncle Adrian, and welcome to Uncle Adrian's Corner. I want to know what's your problem. No, 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 I don't. You know what? Uncle Adrian is not taking any questions today. I want to tell you my problem. I have been pushing and encouraging and nagging and hectoring you all to vote in this election. And I stand by that. But we have fought too hard and for too long. And we have spilled too much blood to secure our voting rights, to sit on our hindquarters and not to use them. The trouble is... As much as I want you to vote, and as much as I hope you want to vote, not everyone is on board with you casting your ballot. This year alone, we've seen all manner of voter suppression. Polling places closed, voting hours cut short, and eligible voters wrongly purged from the voting rolls. With COVID-19 raging across the country like an out-of-control toddler on a sugar high, a responsible government, a government committed to public health and safety would seek to expand vote by mail efforts to reduce the transmission rate. Instead, the current administration is doing exactly the opposite. They're stirring up groundless fears of voter fraud while at the same time encouraging voters to commit fraud by voting twice, once by mail and once in person. To Test the security of the system. Y'all do know encouraging voter fraud is illegal, right? And they're deliberately sabotaging the Postal Service by snatching mailboxes off the street, by removing sorting machines from the postal facilities, and by making changes to the employee overtime that have resulted in millions of packages and pieces of mail being delayed by as much as a week or more. It's almost as if the Postmaster General, a Republican donor appointed by the USBS Board of Governors, who themselves were appointed by the current occupant, are trying to make sure your vote doesn't get counted. These vandals are breaking the system on purpose so they can tell you it's broken, so they can make you not trust it because it's broken. Your vote matters now more than ever, whether you mask up Go early and pack a lunch or fill out your mail-in ballot and mail it or hand deliver it as soon as humanly possible. You have to get it done. A close election will not work this time. It has to be a landslide. There's a solution to that. Vote! What's your problem?